you mga curls. And dami sa inyo mga curls na request ng video na to. Because sis, we weren't expecting this. I mean sis, she came with a vengeance. I mean sis, she said, hold up bitch. She said my pasabo gabi. Because for today's video mga curls, we're gonna be trying the Vice Cosmetics BT21 Part 2 in all its glory. So again, mga girls, we're gonna be trying the Vice Cosmetics BT21 Part 2 and she is back. Nakakasikip ba tong BT21 Part 2 ng Vice Cosmetics? Yung tipo, papansinin ba ako ni V? O baka naman papansinin ako ni V? No. Alright, mga girls, so Vice Cosmetics decided to launch four dewy tints and also they decided to launch four cheeky blushes. Diba? Ang lakas mga glossy, yay. So we shall see, mga girls, if it's gonna look good on dark lips and also on dark skin. Whenever I'm testing any blushes or any cheek products, I wanna make sure I'm not wearing makeup just so so that we can get a real cheek and lip swatches for this. Also, Malkers, make sure you watch till the end of the video because we're gonna be having a giveaway. Because one of you Malkers will get a chance to win of the Vice Cosmetics BT21 Part 2. So make sure you watch till the end of the video for the mechanic. And of course, Malkers, in case you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe down below. Hit that bell notification icon so you're always notified. And lastly, Malkers, I'll be linking all my social media links down below and up here. So without further ado, Malkers, let's get you're probably wondering, uh, Mama Ho, why is your background different? Because we're having renovations right now. I'm forced to film in my bedroom. This is the background, this is the vibe. So, what are you doing? It's like a bedroom. It's like more homey in the background of my bedroom. Ko. Is this a studio? What do you guys think? Like, comment down below. Do you like the studio or the bedroom? So far, I'm liking the bedroom. But for sure, mga girls, babalik ako sa studio. Hindi naman to forever. Obviously, we're having renovations. I'm like literally so excited to share the renovations vlogs kasi who is she, di ba? She's an extreme home makeover channel now, guys. Alright, so I better shut up and let's try these tints. Alright, so I'm gonna start off first with a cheeky blush. They have four shades in total. And also, I have here... And I never fucking learned how to read. It says here, this collection of smooth cream base blushes are are packed with buildable and blendable pigment. Its formula is designed to be easy to use for a perfect finish that leaves your cheeks with a natural flush of colors. Na nakaka fresh lang. All right, so this is only for 195 pesos. So that's actually a really good price. And lakas yung mga glossy. So we have four shades. We have everyday nude. Good everyday nude. We have sheer plum, perfect peach, playful pink. So I'm gonna be trying this on my lips and on my cheeks. All right, Malcro. So I'm just gonna swatch this on my cheeks and on my lips. And I'm also gonna swatch them on the back of my hands and on the palm of my hands so you guys can see the difference on camera. I love you, Malcro's packaging is so cute. Can we just? Super cohesive. So you have artworks here all the way in the back. I really love the packaging. It's so cute. So this is a cheeky blush in the shade Everyday New. Sis, that's a pretty color. Wait. Oh my god. Hold on. Let me just see. So this is in the shade Everyday Nude. It is definitely an Everyday Nude. On camera, you don't see it, but in person, it's here. I like this color. It's so fresh. If you don't use the cream blushes or liquid blushes, this is definitely for you. Or if you're very heavy-handed, this is definitely for you. It's very sheer. I wouldn't say it's like super pigmented that it's gonna make you look like you got punched in the face. It's not. It's very buildable, but it's not super opaque. This is Everyday Nude. It almost blended to my skin color on camera, but in person, you can still see the thing. I like shades like this where it looks like I'm not wearing makeup. They're like, wow, you look different today. I'm like, I don't know. Like, quarantine just hits me differently. Like, like I kind of glowed up. So this is in the shade Everyday Nude on the cheeks. So let's try her on the lips. Let's try Everyday Nude on the lips. This is Everyday Nude on the lips. It's a little bit too light on the lips. I prefer Everyday Nude on the cheek. I tried building it like a couple of times. It's not able to cover my dark lip. If you're looking for like a lip tint that's more moisturizing compared to a traditional lipstick, then this is definitely for you. I have Everyday Nude on the cheeks and on the lips. I like it on the cheeks, but on the lips, not so much. Alright, Malcro, so moving on to the next shade we have is Playful pink. And also, my girls, I almost forgot to describe the color of Everyday Nude. She's almost like a brownie nude, but she's more on the light side. So this is in the shade Playful Pink. This is the packaging. We have Van here. Like, look at that. It does come off easily, though. So let me try Playful Pink. <gasps> I was expecting I would hate this color on the cheeks because it looks a bit too neon when you swatch it. But when you blend it on your cheeks, it doesn't look that neon. This is nice. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. But I feel ko on the lips, hindi ko to This is in the shade Playful Pink. Let's try this on the lip. So let's try Playful Pink on the lip. 
For the cheeky blush, I'm noticing so far on the lips, especially if you have dark lips like me, it's not able to cover your dark lips. But as a blush, it's so beautiful. It looks like it's underneath your skin, but on the lips, since it looks super natural on the cheeks, it's not able to cover your dark lips. So for me so far, when it comes to the cheeky blush, I wouldn't recommend her on the lips. But I'm just swatching it just in case if you're interested in using it on the lips. So yeah, so this is in the shade Playful Pink. Alright, so we have this Sheer Plum. This is like the darkest. Let's give this one a try. Oh my god, wait, oh my god. You know what? I want to mix Mamaya Sheer Plum and Everyday Nude. I'm curious what it's gonna look like. Oh my god, this is the prettiest. Oh my god. Sis. Okay, hold on. Yeah, it's very sheer. I love it. Kalama, it's super dark that you're gonna be intimidated by the color. Na parang it's gonna look like a bruise. I don't know. It looks... Oh my god, that is so nice. So this is Sheer Plum. This is my favorite one. Sheer Plum is that bitch. Alright, so let's try Sheer Plum naman on the lip. This one is able to cover my dark lips because of the tone. So this is Sheer Plum. Yeah, Sheer Plum is my favorite. My personal favorite so far is Sheer Plum. Even if you put it on your cheeks, it looks super sheer. Hindi siya para it looks like a bruise or a... No, a love bruise. It's able to cover my dark lips. It's so nice. I like this. This is Sheer Plum. I want to try Mamaya mixing Sheer Plum with Everyday Nude. I'm curious. What's the shade going to come out? Last shade we're going to be trying is Perfect Peach. Y'all know how picky I am when it comes to peach cream blushes or peach multi use my product so let's see if this is actually good think that nothing could perfect peach if it's literally perfect all right so this is perfect peach this one's a little bit too light for me for me i feel like on the cheeks this will work but on the lips it's not gonna work the cheeks it's beautiful though all right so this is perfect peach on the cheeks that's what it looks like all right so let's try her on the lip this one's a little bit too light on my lips it's a little bit patchy and streaky so obviously it's not able to cover my dark lips because it's a light color so this is perfect peach if you don't have dark lips then this will definitely work on you but i do have dark lips so yeah they're good as a blush for the lips the only thing that i can use on my lips is just sheer plum the rest of the shades a little bit too light for my lips, but on the cheeks, so beautiful. Super natural. It doesn't feel sticky. It feels super light, and you can build it and build it, but it's not super opaque where it almost looks like para sa mukha. No, it's not like that. Or you look like Pikachu or a clown. It looks super sheer. It almost looks like parang naka base makeup ka. And it almost looks like it's underneath your skin. I'm gonna try mixing Everyday Nude with Sheer Plum out of curiosity. So let's see if it's actually cute. Let's see if Sheer Plum will look cute with Everyday Nude. Mix Everyday Nude with Sheer Plum. Okay, okay, so that's what it looks like. Let's try mixing them together. Ooh! Okay, they don't have this shade though. <gasps> Wait, hold on. Oh my god, I swear, trying to buy this or at least two shades, I would definitely recommend Everyday Nude mixed with Sheer Plum. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, this is so pretty. I can't. Okay. Oh, that's my perfect MLBB. Oh, that is so pretty. This is in the shade Everyday Nude mixed with Sheer Plum. I love it. Alright, Malco, so I'm just gonna swatch all the shades on the back of my hand and also on the palm of my hand so you can see the difference. And I'll be right back. This is what it looks like on the back of my hand. This is on dark skin. This is Everyday Nude. This is Playful Pink. This is Perfect Peach. And then this is Sheer Plum. Then on light skin, this is Everyday Nude. This is, this is Playful Pink, this is Perfect Peach, and this is Sheer Plum. Sheer Plum looks really dark, but I swear the formula of this, the cheeky blush, is very sheer. Alright, Malker, so before we move on to the dewy tints, I just want to mention that whenever you see any product, any skincare, lipstick, or anything that you've seen on this channel, or anything on my social media platforms that you happen to purchase, don't forget to always tag me in the hashtag Johnny Made Me Buy This. Mention me on Instagram story so I can give you a mention. And also you can use that hashtag on Twitter so I can give you a retweet. Y'all know the drill. Hashtag Johnny Made Me Buy This. Let's move on to the dewy tints. According to them, it's our classic lip tint with a twist. Lightweight and staining effect of a tint and a dewiness of a lip gloss. Okay. Can be experienced in this innovative formulation. So let's give this one a try. Looking at them right off the bat, they look really dark and promising. Except these two. Okay, so let's give this one a try. So I want to start off first with Brick Red. Oh my god. That smells so good. It almost smells like strawberry. I'm bold. Give Brick Red a try. Oh, that smells so good. It smells really good. Let me just put that on. Ooh. Oh my god. Alam niyo mga I was just blending it out. Actually mga kras, it is glossy. I was blending it out kasi akala ko basa pa. Pero wala siyang transfer. It is glossy. Like look. That is glossy. This is in the shade Brick Red. I like this. Hindi nagpapalamang si Vice Cosmetics Curl. And it's able to cover my dark lips. I want to try it on the cheeks then. 
But I think I won't try it on the cheeks because we all know what lip tint does. As long as it's able to cover my lips, I feel like automatically it's gonna look good on the cheeks. I even use the Maybelline Superstay Eraser to like actually melt the lip tint away, but it doesn't want to come off. So sis, she doesn't need a wear test. Okay, she is the wear test. Grab it, doesn't want to come off. Let me try my best to at least remove this. So this is the best I could do in removing the lip tint. Ah, hirap niya tanggalin. Let's try the lighter shade. Then let's go dark. Cause ah, hirap niya tanggalin. Just so that it looks light and then getting darker and darker and darker. Okay, so this is fresh nude. For me, this is like a lip gloss na lang. Uh, it doesn't have any color for me. Fresh nude. Fresh nude if you're just looking for like a light gloss, go for this. You can even see fresh nude is a little bit too light on my lips, look. So I kind of don't like fresh nude. Parang naglagi lang siya ng gloss from the previous shade, that's all. Shade fresh nude, not the biggest fan of it. Alright, so let's try rosy pink. Yeah, that's pretty. Alright, so this is in the shade Rosy Pink. I do like Rosy Pink. Compared to Fresh Nude, it must be on thing depth. It has a more hint of red. This is Rosy Pink. I like Rosy Pink. So for the final shade for the dewy tint we have is Mary Mom. This is darker compared to Brick Red. I don't know girls, I can't get over it. The lip tint smells so good. It's like a darker version of Brick Red. So when it comes to the dewy tints, longevity wise, without a doubt, this will last super long. Even taking it off was agony. Like, I cannot. It was so hard to remove. Kiss test, like, what I should transfer. And it's still glossy. If you're wearing a face mask, this is definitely a good product. Alright, Mocker, so let me just do the rest of my makeup and I'll be right back with my final thoughts about the Vice Cosmetic BT21 Part 2. And I'll be right back. Alright, Mocker, so I just put on a little bit of makeup and before I share my thoughts, Mocker, I almost forgot, I'm gonna be swatching all the dewy tints on the back of my hand and also on the palm of my hand so you guys can see the difference. So I have all the dewy tints on the back of my hand, the palm of my hand. So this is what it looks like on the back of my hand. So this is Fresh Nude. Then this is Rosy Pink, then this is Merry Mauve, and then this is Brick Red. The shades that you can use are Rosy Pink, Merry Mauve, and Brick Red. And this is on light skin, this is Fresh Nude, this is Rosy Pink, this is Merry Mauve, and then this is Brick Red. Red. By the way, Malkers, if you wipe it off, it does leave a stain. Here's my thoughts about the Vice Cosmetics BT21 Part 2. You are armies and mall curls. Gusto ko lang magpasensya sa inyo and magsorry kasi. Like literally, papagastos kayo. You know what? I actually really like it. When it comes to the cheeky blush, the shades that I like are Sheer Plum and I like the shade Everyday Nude. It's not able to cover my dark lips completely except Sheer Plum. Medyo natitid niya naman kahit pa yung lips ko. But on the cheeks, oh my gosh. And I love these two combos. Everyday Nude mixed with Sheer Plum is pure magic. If you put it on your cheeks, it doesn't look like, it doesn't even look like you're wearing makeup. And it's very easy to blend and I cannot believe this is only for 195 pesos. So if you're looking for a product like yung parang Cloud Paints na Glossier, then Go ahead and get these. These are so good. The dewy tints are really nice. Able to cover my dark lips. It does look dewy on the lips. You have that gloss. It doesn't transfer. I also love the shade the fresh nude, which makes me sad because si RM to de ba? Oh my God, bakit si RM? Bakit si RM yung shade na hindi ko gusto? But anyways, overall, the dewy tints I like all the shades and except fresh nude. So that's my opinion. So ayon nga at sa ganon gusto ko magsorry sa mga army kasi mapapagas to skyo. But don't worry, mga girls and also mga army kasi mayro giveaway. So a lucky winner will win an entire Vice Cosmetics BT21 Part 2 PR kit. So you get the entire shade. So you get the full experience by opening the PR kit. So you get the pouch and everything and even this pamphlet. So all you have to do wrong curls to join the giveaway is just subscribe to this channel. Hit that bell notification icon so you're always notified. And make sure you thumbs up this video and also comment down below Sido you buy a small. Here's the challenge, just one. Because personally, bias ko talaga si Arya. And all you gotta do, mga curls, is just follow my Instagram account because I'll be announcing the winner from my Instagram stories over there on this said date over here. And of course, mga curls, I hope you found this video interesting and helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And of course, mga curls, very important is to stay with my mother. How's the game? Bye!